this was a great idea from Michelle. Um, here are the units and calculations as uh, equations as flashcards. So these are all the equations you're going to need to learn in P2. You will get given this on the formula sheet. And 40% of the higher tier paper in P2 is just based on these equations. So it's an absolutely massive, massive part of it. Um, but they don't give you the units that um, relate the equations to the calculations. So you have to know your units and you have to know how to do the maths properly. I've done loads of videos going through how to do the maths properly. If you're stuck, um, these would be a really good place to go and get some help. So I'm going to pop the um, uh, letter and what it is up there. This information you get on the formula sheet. And then I would like you to have a go at guessing or remembering the unit. So first of all, we have force and then the unit for that is newtons. Mass is measured in kilograms. Acceleration is in metres per second squared, also sometimes written like that, but that's more of an A-level thing, you just might come across that occasionally. The final velocity is in metres per second, and so is initial velocity. Time is always measured in seconds, so make sure whenever you see time, you convert it into seconds. Momentum is a bit of a tricky one, is in kilogram meters per second. Mass, we should be familiar with this one, is in kilograms. And velocity meters per second. Kinetic energy is measured in joules, and you'll notice these come up a lot. Mass is measured in kilograms. Velocity meters per second. Work done is in joules. Force is in newtons. Distance is in meters. One that always confuses people, weight is in newtons because it is the force that you exert upon the earth. Mass, we should remember, completely different to weight, is in kilograms. So this is gravity. Um, they may or may not tell you the unit for gravity, so it is worth remembering. It's 10 newtons per kilogram. Gravitational potential energy is in joules. Lots of different things are in joules, but it's all just different ways of measuring energy. Mass, we should be getting familiar with these. The ones that come up a lot, I'm putting in a lot because you definitely, definitely need to know them. Gravity, 10 millions per kilogram. So height is measured in metres, it's one of the ones that comes up a lot and is called quite a few different things. Force, Newtons. The spin constant is in Newtons per metre. Extension is in metres. Power is measured in watts.
energy is again measured in joules. And time is measured in seconds. Current is measured in amps. Resistance is measured in ohms. That could also be written as ohms. Potential difference is measured in volts. Charge is measured in coulombs. Thanks for watching. I really hope this is helpful. Subscribe so you don't miss any of my new videos. Share to help your friends get better grades. Any comments, corrections, questions or requests down below please.